became important for us because we wanted to see you play against a decent team on the road. And but for you, do you get a sense of how good you guys are? Can you tell how good this team is? I, I, you know, it's a great question. I, I don't, I, and we don't look at it that way. So it, it is a good question, you know, and that's a test for us. But I, I don't know um, because the formula for us in Georgia. Check his head. It's just a one-week deal, you know. And and the teams that are really, really good, you can't, you know, throw your arm on a soccer pat yourself on the back and say, "Hey, what do we do?" You know, because in this league, um, if you do, and, you, and for some reason your mindset isn't where it needs to be, you're gonna get beat. And and especially on the road, you know, USC's loss is on the road. Stanford. Stanford's loss was on the road at Washington. And, and we really preach to our guys that if you want to win the championship, you have to be great on the road. And I think our kids embrace that. But as I tell them, that's not a badge you put in your chest and look what I did. you got to go out and do it again. We, we finished down the stretch with some real big, big road games. And hopefully this gives us a little bit more uh, to pull upon when we get into those situations. But, uh, How close are you to playing your best game? It's a good question. You know, I, I think they help us as coaches because they we didn't play great in the second half. You know, so it's not like those guys are the locker room or side five each other. There's some guys in there that are kind of ticked off a little bit. That, and that's from a coaching standpoint. Not, I won't tell them. I won't go back to the locker room. That's a good thing. You know, we got some teaching still do. Because we're young, you know, we got 65 freshmen and sophomores. So, you know, when we lost two of those seniors that were great part of us, there's not a lot of seniors in our team. Right now. It's still a young operation. So, you know, everything's kind of still new to them the first time they do it, but we've got film that we got to fix to talk about how do, how do we how do we close with the second half, how do we do a better job being up 43-7 and not making it a 43-21. You know, we'll, you know, we call a timeout, we'll tell them they're going to onside kick it. You know, we freshmen still get us out there. But now we got tape kind of showing why did we call a timeout, why do we talk about the onside kick, because you know, sometimes we actually know what we're talking about as coaches. You can listen to